Dr. Travis Scott, formerly a covert government operative, has encountered an unsettling revelation, an entity possessing the capacity to disrupt aircraft functionality. Dr. Scott, expressing profound apprehension, disclosed his concerns during an interview, highlighting the skepticism surrounding his alarming claims despite presenting compelling evidence. He articulated his deepest fear, the manipulation of GPS signals, particularly on his ranch, where they intermittently halt at the perimeter, posing a significant risk to air navigation. Dr. Scott recounted instances of high-value drones crashing due to signal interference, emphasizing the potential for catastrophic consequences, including airplane collisions. The gravity of the situation lies in the ability of such technology to disrupt vital systems beyond GPs, extending to automated drones and vehicles reliant on navigation aids. He underscored the looming threat posed by this phenomenon, urging vigilance against its potentially devastating implications. The most shocking revelation about Dr. Travis came from his affiliation with the U.S. government, specifically as a member of the UAP UFO task force stationed at the Pentagon. This disclosure deeply unsettled his colleagues, who were completely unaware of his government ties throughout their collaboration. Despite their demands for clarification, Dr. Travis could only cite a binding deep QQ agreement as the reason for his silence. Dr. Travis holds a PhD in optical science and engineering, specializing in aerospace engineering, which underscores his vast expertise spanning advanced propulsion, space exploration, and theoretical physics. His involvement in numerous groundbreaking research and development initiatives has consistently pushed the boundaries of technological advancement. His public persona gained prominence through regular appearances on television programs where he adeptly demystifies intricate scientific concepts. Catering to a broader audience and solidifying his reputation as a leading figure in science communication, the narrative takes a riveting turn with the bizarre occurrences at Skinwalker Ranch, where Dr. Travis and his team stumbled upon an invisible force field enveloping the area. Remarkably, this force field exhibits anomalous behavior, disrupting electronic devices and exerting a repulsive force on objects within its vicinity. Employing state-of-the-art sensors, electromagnetic field detectors, and thermal cameras, they strive to decipher the enigmatic nature of this phenomenon. Preliminary investigations suggest that the force field might be comprised of an unconventional form of energy. Skinwalker Ranch, renowned for its mysterious sightings of UFOs, inexplicable creatures, and other perplexing phenomena, continues to captivate the imagination with its ongoing mysteries. For quite some time, scientists and enthusiasts alike have been drawn to investigate Skinwalker Ranch, captivated by its mysteries. Travis, Eric, and Thomas joined forces with Aaron Blunt from Straight Shot Oil Field Services, pooling their expertise to unravel the enigma. Armed with an array of cutting-edge tools and fueled by determination, they embarked on a drilling expedition driven by the quest to uncover the truth concealed behind the perplexing force field. Their endeavor, however, encountered a significant obstacle, an invisible barrier impeding their progress, reminiscent of an insurmountable wall. Proximity to the anomaly unveiled yet another layer of peculiarity, a beacon attached to the drill, emitting signals at 33 megahertz, monitored closely by sophisticated equipment. The signals exhibited erratic behavior, suggesting external interference with the drilling process, as if some unseen force was toying with their efforts. As the team persisted with their drilling, they observed the drill's resistance and anomalous movements, indicative of a dynamic interaction with the obstacle. Notably, during experimental trials, the team discerned a surge in beacon signals upon contact with the obstruction, signaling a complex interplay between the drill and the mysterious entity. Despite concerted efforts, the formidable force field remained steadfast, impervious to over 8,000 pounds worth of power and various attempts at penetration. Remarkably, the drill bit emerged from the ordeal unscathed, devoid of any discernible damage, hinting at the presence of an invisible, impeccably smooth barrier. This revelation marked a pivotal moment for the team, prompting them to delve deeper into the mesa's depths in search of answers to the relentless resistance thwarting their endeavors. The perplexing interaction between the force field and the unscathed drill raised profound questions regarding the underlying mechanics at play. As the team sifted through the data and specimens collected during drilling, they harbored hopes of unraveling the composition and origins of the enigmatic object. The revelations and observations spurred contemplation on various intriguing possibilities.
Could it be constructed from an unknown material boasting extraordinary properties? Might it signify the presence of highly advanced technology or even extraterrestrial involvement? Viewing the experiment as a success, the team noted significant occurrences precisely at the 31-foot mark, aligning with the focal point of their investigation. Skinwalker Ranch's notoriety for UFO sightings has long captured media attention, tracing back to 1996 when the Deseret News in Salt Lake City, Utah first shed light on the peculiar occurrences at the ranch. Investigative journalist George Knapp further stoked interest with a series of articles in the Las Vegas Mercury, delving into reports from a family residing on the ranch who recounted eerie and unsettling experiences, particularly when alone in their home. Situated near the Uinta and Are Indian Reservation, the ranch has earned the moniker UFO Ranch due to its 50-year history of inexplicable phenomena. Thus, when the team ventured into the triangular region, they encountered yet another anomaly, equally as baffling as the invisible force field, further fueling their quest for understanding. Accompanying their expedition were eight thermal cameras, with two possessing notably enhanced clarity. Capable of detecting even the slightest temperature fluctuations with exceptional precision compared to their conventional counterparts. The superior performance of these newer cameras enables them to capture thermal signatures more effectively, particularly from objects emitting heat. Their strategy involves launching objects from the triangle area, ascending over 100 feet, while David, Mason, Eric, and their companions closely monitor the proceedings using the specialized thermal cameras. These cameras excel at detecting rapid temperature changes imperceptible to the naked eye but discernible after the objects have ascended from the triangle region. Initially planning to conduct their experiment in the south field, the team remained flexible, prepared to adapt their approach based on developments within the triangle. They devised a coordinated launch sequence, combining a launcher and mortar, with one individual stationed on each side to initiate firing simultaneously. The synchronized launch was timed to coincide with the activation of the 1.6 GHz sweep, occurring approximately at the 31-foot mark above ground level. As the mortar began its operation, the rocket appeared to traverse its trajectory before abruptly detonating, signaling an unexpected turn of events. As it turned out, the rocket didn't merely pass through the mortar. Rather, an external factor triggered premature detonation resulting in the fragmentation of the rocket shortly after both objects reached the targeted height of 31 feet above the triangle area. Their objective was to induce the formation of the elusive blob-like phenomenon. Remarkably, the incident unfolded precisely at the intended 31-foot mark, adding an extra layer of intrigue to the situation. The circumstances surrounding the event bordered on the surreal, prompting speculation and curiosity about the underlying cause. With the mystery unresolved, one member of the team proposed a bold plan, launching multiple mortars directly into the 31-foot zone. The aim was to ascertain if they could either strike a tangible target or generate a visible phenomenon detectable by David's thermal cameras. This experimental approach reflects their determination to unravel the enigma shrouding the anomalous events occurring at Skinwalker Ranch. In their quest to decipher the origins of the peculiar occurrences, the team resorted to launching multiple mortars directly into the 31-foot zone. Ascending to the apex of the launch tower, they prepared for the subsequent launch, only to be captivated by an intriguing sight on the horizon. Utilizing a specialized thermal camera equipped to detect temperature differentials, they observed a distinct visual representation through color-coded temperature mapping. Areas exhibiting elevated temperatures appeared as vibrant hues of yellow or even stark white against the cooler backdrop. Amidst this thermal imagery, they discerned a region radiating higher heat levels than its surroundings, prompting speculation regarding its significance. Fueled by curiosity, the team hypothesized that their actions might have precipitated the emergence of another enigmatic phenomenon akin to the previous blob occurrence situated between the triangle and the south field. Unanimously agreeing on the necessity of closer inspection, they embarked on a journey towards the southern periphery of the woods guided by the beacon of light they had observed. As they traversed the landscape, the realization dawned upon them that one of their cameras had captured evidence of the anomaly. Validating their pursuit and affirming their determination to unravel the mysteries lurking within Skinwalker Ranch. As they persisted in their exploration, the object they had observed on the camera materialized before them, precisely where the bright anomaly had been detected. Their specialized thermal camera revealed an anomalous glow in the same location, 
visible within the near-infrared spectrum, adding another layer of intrigue to their investigation. This particular aspect of the experiment piqued their interest, yet despite their thorough scrutiny, the source of the luminosity remained elusive. Determined to gain further insights, they proceeded with the rocket launch. Initially, their observation was limited to the rocket's trajectory, with no discernible presence of the mysterious light within its confines. However, to their astonishment, the light suddenly manifested, only to vanish in a fleeting moment, leaving behind an eerie sense of bewilderment. Their keen observation skills notwithstanding, the abrupt disappearance of the light left them confounded, prompting a collective decision to revisit their initial observations for validation. These discoveries at Skinwalker Ranch provoke profound questions about their implications. Could Dr. Travis's affiliation with the U.S. government lend credence to the existence of extraterrestrial spacecraft traversing our planet? The engagement of the UAP UFO task force with Dr. Travis, who presents compelling evidence of potential calamities resulting from the supernatural phenomena at Skinwalker Ranch, raises intriguing possibilities about the nature of these phenomena and their significance.